Hey, hey, this is Sky with Smart Poker Study. You're about to watch a preview video for my Smart HUD that comes with a 75 minute webinar. Now, I've been using my Smart HUD for years to help me understand the opponents at my tables and to give me ways or to show me ways that I could potentially exploit their tendencies. Now, in the six slides that you're about to see, I cover my six sections of the Smart HUD, also the six custom pop-ups that, that I created with them with the hundreds of stats that detail your different opponents' tendencies. Two of the slides come directly from the webinar to give you kind of a feel for what I teach in the webinar. And the webinar is full of different exploits based on HUD statistics that you see in your opponent's HUD and in their pop-ups. So roll that beautiful bean footage. The Smart HUD comes with three different versions. The first is a cash game Smart HUD. You can see it right there, 18 different elements to it. The Six Max Tournament HUD has 24 elements because of this additional second line here, which are all steel related stats. And the Full Ring Tournament uh, comes with these 18 elements on it. Now the HUD is a tool, so take a look up in the top right. We've got Villain 2 right there. We have over 5,000 hands on Villain. All their most important stats are right there. Now. This tool helps to answer the question, how often does my opponent blank? So how often does my opponent play hands? Well, 29% V pip and they raise preflop 21% of the time. How often do they fold to three bet? 61%. How often do they see bet the flop? 45%. Knowing their frequencies allows us to make some exploitative plays. For example, this person plays a lot of hands. So let's three bet or call pretty frequently. They fold a three bet a lot, let's three bet bluff them. And they also are pretty honest when it comes to making that flop C bet. So we probably want to fold all of our junk hands against their C bet. Now the Smart HUD comes with six custom pop-ups as well. The first is the Assassinato pop-up. This is a general pop-up for pre and post flop tendencies and it helps to answer the question, what type of player are they? The second pop-up is the steel pop-up. How often do they fold versus steals? It also tells us, as you can see, how often do they steal in general and some post-flop stats right there as well. The third pop-up is the raise first in and fold to three bet. This one tells us how often they raise first in and then fold to our three bet, allows us to make a few more bluffs right there. Uh, the, third, the fourth pop-up is the three bet pop-up. How often do they call two bets or how often do they three bet? The fifth is the C bet pop up. And you can imagine what this tells us. How often do they C bet? And fold to C bet. Of course, this answers the question how often do they fold versus a C bet? Now, this is a little mind map of the 75 minute Smart HUD webinar. And you can see all the different things I teach within the Hubinar. Uh, Hubinar, within the webinar. The most important are the six different sections of the HUD. And you can see the two different HUDs here uh, Six Max Tournament, Cash Game HUD. Uh, talk about, you know, these are the six different sections of it. I also cover the six pop ups and give you really good details by position, by street of all the statistics within this. I also tell you how to exploit all the different stats that you see. When somebody's doing something too frequently, we can exploit that. Not frequently enough, we can exploit that. And that's what I call exploit at the extremes. And of course, I give you some action steps to help you take action on and off the felt. And these are the bonuses, but we'll get to those in just a sec. Now, this is a little bit detailed or uh, yeah, this is a detailed look at the steel pop-up of one particular opponent. You can see the BL is their name down here, shortened name. When I click on the steel section of the cash game smart HUD, bam, this pops up right here. Now, the steel pop-up, it tells you everything for facing and making steals. So this player, their steals are pretty high. Look at those percentages right there, especially on the button but they fold 0% of the time. So what we need to do, because they are raising and not folding, we need to value bet big with our strongest hands because they're calling with weaker ones. Now, their three bet in the small blind is semi-high at 7.4%. The big blind, pretty darn high at 15.6%. So in both positions, but especially the big blind, we've got to expect those three bets re-steals when we steal against them. Now, this player hates folding the big blind versus a small blind steal. As you can see, 22%. So do not steal out of the small blind. Go for value instead because they do not fold. 
Now, the CBET stats down here, they are here so you can gauge what to expect on the flop before calling or stealing against them, or calling their steal or stealing against them. Now, this particular player, they don't fold to C-bets often when they're in position, as you can see right here. In position, fold to C-bet, 35, 38, and 0. So what we want to do is C-bet bluff with our best draws only when out of position. Because they ain't folding, we ain't bluffing when we are out of position against them. Alrighty, when you get the Smart HUD, you get more than just the Smart HUD. It comes with, of course, the three HUDs, the webinar, the webinar slides, a 28-day Smart HUD plan, four different videos to help you get more out of the Smart HUD, color coding stat spreadsheet so you can see the different color codings I have assigned to the stats in the HUD, and, of course, a Smart HUD pop-ups PDF for quick reference with all six pop-ups on it. So to purchase the Smart HUD, if you're watching this on Gumroad, just simply click the purchase button below. If you're watching on YouTube, click the link in the description, or you can type in this page directly. And because you've watched this video to the end, I do appreciate you taking the time. So please use offer code POD10 for 10% off.